without uh, studying about the life of fossils, dead organisms or living organisms, are you keen about studying about various organisms? Then biology is the forte for you. Well, in this video, we're going to talk about biology based careers. If you are a young student who's aspiring to study or pursue your career in the field of biology with biology as your major, then this video is for you. So I've put together a handful of careers, which is primarily biology based, both that are contemporary and futuristic as well. So let's get going and then see what do we have on our list. Let's begin with a, a set of careers. Here. So typically when you talk about biology, biologist is the one that comes to everybody's mind. And of course, yes, and it is nothing but the studying of living organisms, their interactions, specializing in various areas. And the next one is microbiologist, which is purely about microorganisms, bacteria, viruses, fungi, and so on. So that's the area of specialization. The next one is botanist. This is purely uh, based on the uh, research or the study on plants, their growth, reproduction, adaptation, and so on and so forth. And, and of course, there's something interesting as well, ecologist. It is about the studying about ecosystems, interactions, and environmental relationships, and so on. So those are, uh, you know, the a set of careers to begin with. And of course, uh, uh, as we keep moving, here is another set of careers. Uh, uh, genetics, it's basically about genetics, uh, physiology, molecular biology, biotechnology. So these are the other set of careers. Uh, and of course, uh, these are uh, uh, again, a lot of prospective, uh, uh, purely biology based, getting into a specialized area. And by the way, let me remind you, if you wish to pursue a career in biology or biology based careers, uh, then the requirement would be biology, physics, chemistry should be ideally your major set of plus two level. Uh, immediately after you complete your 10th uh, grade, either you choose uh, biology, physics, chemistry, it is called as a, a BIPC or PCB or a medical stream as they call it. We are not going to limit our conversation here only about healthcare and medicine, but we'll look at what are the other areas as well. And let's see uh, the next set of uh, uh, careers on the list uh, bioinformatics uh, biomedical scientist uh, pharmacologist uh, pharmacology is all about drugs pharmaceuticals and biological systems and biomedical scientist is more about research uh, medical laboratories to improve the well-being of patients and to advance the healthcare and so on bioinformatics is basically using the uh, the biological data and to interpret various scenarios which will help in research or various uh, a drug development or um, any any advancement in the field of biology well the next set is epidemiology biostatistics wildlife biologist like wildlife biologist is about um, you know researching and studying about the wildlife species and their ecosystem which who suits where who doesn't uh, know fit where in which kind of environment what are the various requirements that's all about bi wildlife biology and biostatistician is basically a little bit of statistical knowledge applying uh, you know to interpret the biological data so that would yield a lot of benefits uh, as we advance uh, from any healthcare development it could be a vaccination development it could be drug development or it could be anything for that matter uh, you know this is going to help and epidemiology it's basically about um, you know, uh, the, this is uh, this person who is an epidemiologist uh, who will focus on uh, investigating the spread and control of disease within populations when you have a widespread uh, you know, outbreak. So these are the people who would actually, you know, look into those segments. And the next one is marine biologist. Uh, this is one of the very interesting and very, very fascinating career, uh, marine life and ecosystems in oceans and seas. If you are very curious about undersea aquatic life and so on, then your work location, if you want to be a marine biologist, be aware your work location will not be in a cozy office with an air conditioned room and all with you, but you will be doing a deep dive, uh, you know, under the sea into the oceans and so on. Conservation biologist, they primarily, uh, you know, focus on protecting endangered species and habitats. We, we, we have been hearing a lot of uh, endangered species right 
so this is something like conservation biologist and uh, ornithologist uh, this is the study of birds and their behaviors and uh, there was a recent uh, socio fantasy movie uh, in in the last few years they have come up uh, where the in the study of birds expert uh, uh, ornithologist uh, so you might uh, be remembering there are uh, on and off there there comes some uh, you know socio fantasy movies and uh, one of the characters study about uh, the birds and so on so this is something of that sort and the next one is entomologist uh, environmental consultant uh, and forensic scientist and of course forensic scientist and in, in the years to come uh, forensics are going to play a crucial role and every crime would eventually over a period of time had to go through some forensic evidences uh, so becoming a forensic expert forensic scientist would always yield better prospects in the years to come in the decades to come environmental consultant they are the one who uh, you know are an expertise in environmental issues and conservation of various natural resources and so on an entomologist uh, like ornithologist this is a study of insects and their roles in ecosystems and now and then we keep hearing that there's a lot of insect development uh, they have been reinstating some of these inst insects at certain areas uh, so that there is a, there's a balance in the nature right and of course next one is cytotechnologist this is about uh, screen cells for abnormal uh, they screen uh, cells and abnormal abnormalities um, and diseases in medical settings uh, toxicologist biomedical engineer and i'm sure biomedical engineering is the one which would have been heard quite frequently who uh, who basically develop and design various medical equipment like for example if i were to ask a question who invented stethoscope you know uh, there there is a name to it uh, but definitely not necessarily a doctor has to invent it but a biomedical engineer can develop innovate and uh, you know come up with such medical equipment whatever and evolvements are happening toxicologist is about the one who studies about various toxins and chemicals uh, on living organisms so those are some of the other set of careers my friends and uh, the list continues a biochemistry research scientist cell biologist plant uh, uh, genetics it's about working on plant genetics and breeding how how composition what composition has to be brought together if you were to uh, you know uh, come up with a new breed cell biologist is about the structure and function of various cells primarily insects or various other aspects and biochemistry research scientist is about doing a researcher becoming a scientist who primarily focuses on biochemical processes and their reactions so look at the depth and breadth of roles if you come up with a biology physics chemistry as your major subjects which is pcb or bypc as they call it you don't necessarily have to limit your options only to become a doctor or a healthcare professional look at the various widespread opportunities that are available so it is a matter of being aware and then exploring those possibilities now so far we have seen some of those contemporary now it is time to look at a few of uh, the uh, you know futuristic or trending careers but let me remind you my friends here on this note uh, these this list is an indicative list of careers or occupations or possibilities they are not an exhaustive list this itself would enhance your uh, i assume and i hope this in this this list itself would enhance your thought process and it will increase improve your options career options you don't have to limit yourself only to become a doctor or a surgeon or purely a healthcare professional look at this bioinformatics a synthetic biologist biomedical engineer biomedical data analyst a couple of them we have talked in the earlier segment as well in the contemporary careers but <clears throat> here they are a future prospective there is a lot of untapped potential when it comes to biomedical engineering or bioinformatics or biomedical data analysis or synthetic biology synthetic biologist is basically they look at uh, the, uh, the the design and uh, engineer various healthcare agriculture and biotechnology related areas so so let's keep going and see what else do we have on the list stem cell therapist clinical genetic counselor immunotherapy researcher environmental biotechnologist look at look at these options and i'm sure some of them would, uh, would you wouldn't have even heard about them stem cell therapist stem they 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 basically focus on 
regenerative medicine using stem cells uh, you know there are a lot of laboratories which have come up uh, uh, you know in the last 10 years uh, who would preserve these stem cells uh, at birth uh, so that uh, they could be used at various uh, you know uh, medical requirements in future of that uh, individual clinical genetic counselor uh, they provide guidance uh, uh, to families about uh, genetic testing inheritance and potential risk of genetic conditions uh, so i always uh, keep selling this genetic counselor uh, uh, keep telling about this uh, you know typically in, in in indian culture we look at horoscope to get married uh, you know to a boy and a girl uh, when we want to fix a marriage uh, horoscope plays a key role in most of our uh, um, uh, you know most parts of a country of course everybody has got their own belief system but largely uh, this is one of the common phenomenon we look at but uh, future is going to be a genetic compatibility will also have to be looked at uh, over the years in the, in the next 25 30 years we don't know and i hear that this is already happening uh, uh, in some of those western uh, you know places uh, immunotherapy researcher immunotherapy researcher is primarily about uh, you know they focus on uh, you know the immune system the uh, which can help fight diseases including cancer and autoimmune disorders and of course environmental biotechnologies is about the maintaining the sustainable uh, you know environmental friendly or handling the environment or dealing with the environmental challenges uh, like uh, pollution and waste management and so on so my friends uh, all these careers uh, that we have talked about they are primarily requiring a biology as a major subject uh, typically after 12th grade with by pc or pcb or uh, medical stream whatever you call depending on whichever location you are uh, eventually you could do a bsc biology as a major and some of these specializations are offered at an undergraduate level and if not they are for sure being offered at a post graduation level so the basis is after 10th grade if you are very curious about studying uh, studying about the life living organism dead organism and their different interactions and so on then biology is the area and this would require to you for you to choose after your 10th grade at 11th and 12th plus 2 level biology physics chemistry as your mainstream subjects and eventually uh, laid on a path uh, for yourself into these careers and as usual i keep reminding that this is an indicative list of careers my friends please pick up the clues from this video and then do your own research do do the due diligence talk to a counselor your mentor and then eventually make an informed career decision and i hope that information was useful and it adds value to your contest your thought process or your knowledge or at least it will help raise the awareness and thank you so much for watching this video and if you like this please don't forget to like share and subscribe so that it gives us an encouragement to come up with more valuable content and videos in future until then take care